Hello again, everybody. This is Timothy Hoxley here in World, and also Timothy Rogers in Real Life and on Grid Press. I'm doing yet another video of the grid that was ranked number one in almost all across the board for the most um, user friendly, the most, the quickest support, and leader in technology and content. <laughs> Apologize if I forgot anything, and also apologize because I have a bit of a cold today, so hope you'll bear with me. Anyways, in case you're wondering, we are in Lost Paradise. I have hypergrided here from OS Grid because this grid is hypergrid enabled. Meaning, if you have an ad account on another grid such as OS Grid or another grid that is hypergrid compatible, you get to come in, check it out before you even, you know, before you even sign up, if you want to sign up. Well, this is where I just landed. I'm taking a look around, and I have to say, right off the back, it looks very beautiful down here. And right there seems to be their hypergate. Very awesome. Now you get to find your way back to your own grid if you're still new to the hypergrid. And then over here, it looks like we have lost computer control. Let's take a look what we got behind door number one here. Oh, very interesting. This must be their workstation in real life where the grid is hosted. And now I think this is really cool showing off what you're running and how it's running and where it's running. The wires, connection. A bit messy, but <laughs> I think it's very cool to show off exactly how you're doing things. So, let's go on and continue exploring this beautiful landing area. Now, I will say it was a bit a little crowded, but I don't mind. It took it didn't take that much longer to load. <coughs> Again, sorry about my cold. All right, it looks like they're running 075, which is the current dev release. Oh, these stairs right off the bat. I am seeing tons of stores and a very lovely layout here. Absolutely loving look at this place already. It seems very relaxing. Alright, and coming into this store, it looks like their land store. Alright, so right off the back, we get to look at the pricing. Seem to sell lots for $10 per month. It don't see how big their lots are, so I can't say I know. <clears throat> but it looks like a full region, which is 15,000 friends, is $40. The Super States, which looks like it's going to be a 4 by 4 mega, well, 2 by 2 mega region, which has 60 regions, I mean 60,000 friends, and $150 per month. That does not seem that bad of a price. A little steep. Our mega region, but that is a lot of friends. You'd be more than set. Alright. Continuing to walk around the other way this net this time now. Uh, looks like a lot of this stuff is um welcome freebies, a couple stores. It looks like some of the stuff is Linda Kelly's. Some stuff is collected across the hypergrid, possibly some by the room residents, because I haven't seen it before. <laughs> Definitely looks really nice. I just love the center here. It just looks really beautiful. I mean, I like that waterfall back there, the bridge. We're going to take a closer look at that. Some stuff right here from the hair salon. I can tell that some of that stuff's from Fleet Grid. Another waterfall. It's beautiful, honestly. There's just a lot of stuff here. <coughs> Some furniture store right off the back. You know, the fencing and hedging, hedge trimming is pretty nice. Alright, more furniture. Down there is where we came in at. I mean, come on, this is quite beautiful of <coughs> a welcome area. Let's come over here. Yes, absolutely beautiful, stunning view. The bridge just looks absolutely beautiful. <coughs> Again, I apologize for this cold. 
how I move forward and let's take out this uh, Black Shield of Falworth. Huh. Looks like we have a little bit of a dance hall here or a club at the welcome area. Alright, now that we've explored the welcome area, which is absolutely beautiful, it's not overcrowded, and it's not really undercrowded either, it's just very beautiful. Alright, we're gonna move this way, and it looks like we have a sign here. Alright, click here for a note card with the landmarks of these places and other places of interest. Like on the picture to TP to that location. Alright, well let's see what they got. So this is the welcome area. And this looks like a dance area. And then the Kelly's Freebie Mall. Uh, the Roller... Roller Rama. And... I'm going to tell what that is. Probably written on it. And Lost Paradise Rome. Well, I've heard some things about this down here. Um, it's, we're gonna go check this out. It's supposed to have 150 rims on it. Not down. Well, looks like we won't be going there. Let's take a look at this place here. I would like to see that directory a little bit cleaner so I know where I'm going. But, right off the bat, Things are rendering quite quickly for me. See, so we already teleported here and almost everything's already loaded. Um, right away, I have to say, it looks absolutely stunning so far. I haven't seen anything that I really don't like yet. Other than the welcome area seems a bit confusing if you're brand new to virtual worlds, or which I don't think they're trying to appeal to the brand new users, it doesn't seem. Um, I will also say that the, what we just saw, the boards, I'd like to see a little bit better organization of those boards, maybe uh, more text describing what places are, uh, no card, I should have put that so you guys more descriptive, but still, uh, no, no harsh feelings, but sometimes it's nicer to see a picture, so you feel like pictures, and you don't like to read, and I'll I'll admit that I'm bad about that myself. So it looks like this is. Hmm, I'm not really sure what this is. No. 30 day free trial land. Huh. I guess this is uh, where they give away free land to try. <coughs> I'm walking around here. It looks absolutely beautiful. Some sculpts are not fully rest yet, but I don't think I'm supposed to be inside there. <laughs> Just take a look at this lovely little place here. It's absolutely beautiful. The rocks, the waterfalls. Um, there's a little entrance down there in the water. It's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I have to say that um, I can see why a lot of people said that the content is very awesome and looks very high quality because I will say that almost everything I'm seeing looks really good. Only problem is I haven't really found any stores or anything. Maybe it, it could just be my fault because I don't really know what I'm looking for or how to get around. Again, is something that could be my fault. Might not be my fault. Parcel number seven. Hmm. Well, let's go take a look at another one of the locations and let me click the note card this time to see if it's any better information for me. <clears throat> Freebie at the Rose Garden. Alright, well, let's go check out that Rose Garden then. Uh, garden. Okay. Rose Garden. There we go. 
and let's go take a look at what they got at this freebie first card. This is a little more detailed in the note card. Apologize. And that up decently fast. I'm um, still rendering a bit of stuff here. Uh, I can tell right away that they're using OMC. My avatar has a balance in OMC, so we can see that balance reflected in the top right hand corner of my viewer. If you don't already know what OMC is, it's a currency system that, allows, that is secure that allows you to buy stuff between different hyper grid enabled grids, or if the grid's not hyper grid enabled, they just chose to enroll in the system. It is by Verox, one of the oldest London exchange groups out there, and I don't see any reason why people should not trust it. <clears throat> well, I don't really see anything here. Maybe it's just not rezzing for me. Maybe I'm missing it. Hmm. Let me do. Draw this and slow it down. Run back up again. No. Huh. <coughs> again, I apologize for this cold. I want to see what else they have. A light pink boy and a not a bit pink boy. Alright, and they have a total avatar shop, so let's take a look at that. And then I'm just gonna hop out. So. Sunny Island. And we're going to take a look at this. I personally think it looks beautiful. The content level of stuff seems very professional, very in depth. Um, This is the Avatar shop. There's a currency for Verox. Uh, it looks absolutely beautiful around here. But in the end, not to be mean, not being upset, but personally, I'm having trouble seeing a lot of stuff here. And I would like to be able to be invited back by somebody eventually and have them take me around. See the lot of stuff that I missed. I, I really think that the only things that these people can improve upon, if they're not going for brand new users, would be <coughs> well not I mean like brand new to straight virtual worlds. If they were doing that I would just suggest having a, a more in-depth tutorial welcome. Or well a, and a tutorial at the welcome area. Or, if you're just doing like you are now, I think it's absolutely perfect, absolutely wonderful. Just, uh, your board tells you places to visit. Maybe needs a little revamping. Maybe the note card a little revamping. Um, nothing against it. I thought, I really like your grid. It looks absolutely beautiful. Just my personal opinion. And, I absolutely have to say, um love it and what I could see but I'm a little lost and I apologize it might be my own fault anyways I will see everyone around and this is Timothy Rogers and Timothy Hawksley from OS Grid signing off